All right, Jen St. Dennis back with us from Business in Vancouver. And Jen, we mentioned last, half, uh, last hour, just after your business report, about Diane Watts. And we all know that she hopes to run for uh, office in Ottawa. But right now, she has another job. Yeah, yeah, she, she, she has a new gig. Uh, she's only been out of the mayor's chair a couple of months now, uh, but she is going to be the new CEO of Surrey's Health Tech uh, Foundation. Sorry, I have that right? Health Tech Foundation. So uh, this is kind of a continuation of some of the work she was doing as mayor, actually. She was a big backer of this idea of developing this thing called Innovation Boulevard in Surrey. So the idea is to really work to attract technology companies, especially health technology companies, to this one area of Surrey uh, with the idea that there's already a few anchors there, like Surrey Memorial Hospital, uh, Kwantlen School of Nursing, and uh, SFU's Surrey campus. So this is kind of going to be a continuation of her work. The foundation's purpose is to work with companies who are thinking of relocating or already there, kind of get help them get access to resources. It's going to be operating out of this building across from Surrey Memorial uh, called the Innovation Hub. Um, so she'll be sort of continuing the work she was already doing. Now, you mentioned her uh, her plans to run. She is, uh, back in September, she did say that she would seek the Conservative nomination for Surrey White Rock, and uh, that federal election is coming up. It needs to be held by October 2015. Uh, so she could be, uh, if she runs and if she's successful, she could be on to a new gig soon. Wow, interesting. All yeah. right, well, we'll see what happens to that. Okay, yeah, Jen, you know. thanks very much. Have a good day. Okay, you too.